What is up, everybody? We are back again with some more Stellar Blade. We just got done doing all the side missions, essentially, uh, up to the orbit elevator. So now we can finally focus on the main mission again. And so the main mission is Oracle's testimony, which says talk to Adam, what preparations to leave for the orbit elevator are complete. So obviously that's complete, and we're going to go ahead and head over to the orbit elevator now. Are you ready to leave now? No regrets. Hey, just a reminder. We're heading into space, so expect the journey to be a long one. You should try to take care of everything you need to in Zion before we leave. Oh man, are you serious? Traveling? Okay, let me go back. Give me a bit of time. Sure. We can wait as long as we need to. There, there's like two side missions left. I guess I should just do them now. But I'm gonna... Man, this, this fish one is gonna be a little bit hard, I think. This one specifically... Honestly, I'm just gonna have to like look up. Because I have no idea where I need to go to... To get the passcode for this thing. Oh, so it says we need the chapter, the chapter of trials. Let me see. Data bank. So I guess we need all of these prayers right here. So we're missing five, five and seven are the ones that we were missing. So let me go ahead and get trial number five, which is in the wastelands. So I guess that's my bad. I didn't realize. Are you ready to leave now? No regrets. That after I came here, I would be essentially done. Like it doesn't give me any more chances to come and do any more side missions. So I kind of, I'm kind of forced to, to go ahead and try this and finish up these side missions. So according to this map that I'm looking at, one of the trials should be close to this area. So yeah, it should be around here somewhere. Oh, there it is. Yeah, I guess I missed this. So this is trial five, eight days upon, sorry, eight days upon 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 eight days shall pass. When the land is barren and the heavens, he heavens empty, and when human, metal, wisdom, and mother are forgotten, the angels will come. So now, I think now that I have that, I can go ahead and do this, or this up here. All right, come on. And yep, there we go. So now I have access to them all. Uh, let me just see what it's going to be. So it's B O A Y. Right, P O A Y. There was one that looks kind of like a G. Yep, and then this one. And there you have it. We get uh, another pattern, a reward. That looks kind of cool. Oh, we also got this one. I forgot. I actually really like this one.
after of salvation zero. She will make the choice. Return to the colony and make new memories at the cost of, lo of lost memories. Trials will only end at the hands of the angel. Salvation will come. We pray, yet we do not meet. Yet we do not. We hear Mother Sphere's voice, yet we do not. The angel is blessed, yet she is not. Okay. Looks like all right. Finally. It's weird that it says I'm not going to be able to come back to Zion. But for example, there's still this right here. I don't have the passcode for this, so like, uh, yeah. I'm obviously missing some things. I just don't really feel like looking for it all. I guess it is what it is. Alright, so the last mission, the last side mission, Catchy Channel Catfish. My, fa my father, who was the best scavenger, was also crazy about fishing. He used to fish at the brooks nearby the exit from Zion to the wasteland. Whenever he came back from fishing, he used to cook me some of the channel catfish he caught on his own. Though the fish looked ugly, its chewy, soft texture and sumptuous taste is unforgettable. I'd like you to catch one for me. I want to cook channel catfish using what I learned from my father. Using wriggling insects as bait is best for catching ca channel catfish. Come on. Got it. Yes. Oh, that's definitely it. Oh, thank God. This much is the data of the fish the client wanted. A bulletin board? All right then. Yes, let's go. Oh my god, now we have an, an extra one. And of course, it's another fish one. I can't just ignore it. Okay. On land, the only organic life forms are humans and Etibas. However, there are a variety of life forms underwater. I'm talking about fish. Aren't fish organic life forms? I'm researching how to turn organic life forms into energy. I succeed, I will be able to channel the energy I get from the fish to body cells. Though one fish may yield a very small amount of energy, it won't be a problem if I learn how to breed them. This one scavenger used to breed halibuts near the clock tower in Ido 7. I need some halibut to use as samples. Can anyone catch some for me? To catch halibut, you might want to purchase fish slice bait and fishing data from Clyde and the Oasis. As carefree as ever, I see. So, what brings me? Oh, improves fishing skills. Is that it? Farewell, Angel. I have no idea when we'll, we'll see each other again someday. Alright, so I'm guessing we can't buy any more fishing Angel. data. The 
weather in the oasis. As carefree as ever, I see. So, what brings you? Hey, right, we're good. Leaving? If you find yourself thinking about it. All right. All right, so let's go ahead and get started. Hopefully that fishing data really makes a difference. Oh man, there's no way I'm gonna get it this time. Did I get it? Is that it? Trigger fish? That's not it. That's not it. Damn it. Wait, fishing options. What's this? Let's just try this. See what this does. I am struggling with fishing. And it's not like I really care too much about it. I just want to clear the, the mission. Oh my god. That is insanely easy. There's no challenge to that at all. Wait, what? I'm not even gonna lie though, I don't really care. I'm just gonna keep going at it. But honestly, if you can do this, I'll props to you. This is just crazy, actually like crazy hard to me at least. Holy moly. Ocean sunfish. That thing was massive. E bass. This has to be the place, right?
Here, let me just double check again. Goddamn lobster. What's the point of telling me to come here if... I'm gonna be catching all these other different types of fish before I even catch the halibut. This is my last try, by the way. If I don't get it here, I'm gonna have to literally go back just to purchase... ...some extra stuff. Oh my god. Yes! That's it! Let's go! So this must be a halibut. So flat. It's funny. A bulletin board? All right then. Let's take a look at what's happening in Zion. No, that was too much. Oh my god, another fishing quest. My father was the best scavenger and a fishing maniac. I'm sharing some interesting information I found in his diary. There is a hidden cave nearby the solar tower in the wasteland. It used to be a fishing spot only my father knew. On his last fishing day, he dropped by the cave and left a gift for fellow fishing maniacs. If you're a fishing maniac like him, you can become the owner of this gift. The passcode for the chest is 0508. Good luck finding it. I denied it. Oh, okay, okay. I thought <laughs> I pressed circle, so I thought I denied it. Alright. Let's see what's in here. Some type of fishing rod or something. Fishing data could be useful for catching bigger fish. All right, and there you have it. A bullet. All right then. <laughs> God damn. I will reward you handsomely if you leave information here about the fantastic bait. Memo. I fill in uh, entries I fill in twenty entries of the fishing codex by catching twenty different fish and visit Clyde. Gain information about the fantastic bait from Clyde. Visit Roxanne, the info dealer in Zion. Purchase information about fantastic bait from Roxanne. When will I get the reward? I will track you down to the end of the world if it means I can get that reward out of you. The client drowned himself while fishing on the plant while fishing at the plant in the wasteland. Got my reward by liquidating the client's assets. Whoever finds the fantastic bait can have the rest of his fortune. If I combine these notes, I can get a hold of some fantastic bait. Do I need to first it's 20 different fish?
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. No, oh my god, I need, still need so more. So much more. Either way, let's go to Clyde first. Just to buy more bait. Angel. That's right, Clyde. Well, you've... Yeah, yeah. In the way I see it, you may as well... Yeah? That's... Well, that's that. yourself thinking about all right okay let's try this out let's use the special bait we haven't done that yet that should for sure give us some good fish I think and I guess I'm mainly just looking to get new fish I don't really care about the size but if I haven't used a special bait, I would assume that I'm going to get a different type of fish here. Hey, there we go. That's a big one. And a new one. There we go, with another new fish. It's in different locations. So that, this way. Ooh, this is gonna be a good one. Uh, this way, once I realize like, okay, I've caught all the fish that I can in one area, I can just move on to a different area. Rather than like, wasting my time trying to catch all the fish in one area. Cause I think only certain fish are available in certain areas. Nice. Okay, so let's see here. The best method would be to go for... We can't get the jumbo. Because we don't have the right bait for that. So we need to go for the large and medium fish. How many do we have now? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. So we need 7 more fish. I mean, according to this, a lot of the large, all the large ones, which we need three more, are in the clock, are at the clock tower. Yeah, let's go back to the clock tower. Is that new? Yeah, there we go. New fish. Alright. See how long we can go with the strange bait. Ooh, is that new? Let's go... I ain't doing pretty good here.
Ooh. There we go. Alright, how we doing here? Five. Eleven. Fourteen. Sixteen. Doing pretty good. We'll need four more new ones at least. Hey, there we go. Goldfish. We needed that. So now we've gotten every single small fish, actually. be all right i'm down yeah we don't we haven't got that one either I don't think I've caught this before. Yeah, there we go. Flying fish. Alright, I still need one more, I believe. Let me just double check on that. So I have 6, 8, 14, 17, 19. Yep, I need one more. Come on. Oh my god, I fucking got it. Let's go. Holy shit, finally. No, 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 no. Cancel that. Oh my god. I'm so happy right now. God damn. I just took so long. Alright, come on. Get up there. Come on. Welcome, Angel. And it looks like your fish... Is that so? Yeah. Looks like you can start going to the spots with really big ones. You'll be able to catch them with the right mindset. All right, Clyde. I'll take your advice to heart. So, what brings the... There it is. Fantastic bait. Fantastic fishing data. Well, I guess that's not fantastic bait. Uh, so long, Clyde. Mm. I was wrong about that. It wasn't so bad. So, but we can improve our fishing. One. <laughs> now there. Yes. And then. I assume the fishing has been going. Whatever happens. We can ask about the fantastic bait. I'm sure by now you've caught onto the importance of bait. Isn't that right? Of course. A bait can make a huge difference. Yeah, that's what we're gonna need if we're trying to go fishing for real. Except no substitutes. Maybe we can call it Fantastic Bait. Fantastic Bait? Yeah, and I only have one piece, so I can't sell it. Don't even know where I'd go looking to get more. If you manage to get your hands on that, I'll let you in on the location of the best fishing spot I know. All right. Fantastic bait, you say. Maybe I'll get lucky. You're leaving? If you find yourself thinking about it. All right. Okay. Let's take a look at the mission. 
Going the 20 entries for of the fishing codex by catching 20 different fish. Visit Clyde. We did that. Gain information about the fantastic bait from Clyde. We did that. So now we gotta visit Roxanne. Back in Zion. Good to see you, Angel. Hello. I much prefer you to yes. Fantastic bait. There we go. Information about it. The power efficiency of the nano elements is so mind is so mind blowing that Tetrastar advertised their micro machines as having infinite work time according to the corporate reference plans. It wasn't a lie, and because of that, a variety of micro machines appeared, offering practical use in several fields. I'm sure you can imagine which fields. Fishing maniacs use micro drones embedded with Tetrastar's licensing mark as fishing bait and toss them into the water. They were 100% waterproof, held lifetime power, and perfectly mimicked a small fish's movements. It was truly fantastic bait. Those types of micro machines are no longer produced. However, if you can get your hands on if you can get your hands on old goods assuming they're still intact, of course they might still move and like they should. Try searching the water near the Great Canyon in the wasteland. There's a report that there's this fantastical item. There's a report that this fantastical item is there. Oh, and remember the code. By searching the water near the Great Canyon in the wasteland. Oh, but that's a weird. <laughs> we should be able to get this as well. We're able to get this one just from the passcode that we had found. Uh, I have no idea when, but I do remember when I was looking at the database that we had all the passcodes here. So I knew that we were going to be able to open that one. I remember there was a way to go down. There it is. So through here was the chest. Just gotta remember exactly where it was. Oh, I see it. Oops. Come on. Why can't I go down? What the hell is happening? Oh, is it the bubbles? Bubbles are like interfering? Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Forgot about that. So there's actually a different path that we can take. This should still take us over there. Okay, we're okay, right here. Yeah, this is definitely it. And yep, that's the code that we got from purchasing the data from Roxanne. It's the fantastic base. There it is. Now we'll go ahead and return back to the bulletin board and clear the mission. I wonder if there's going to be even more after this. Oh my god, there's going to be one more. <laughs> Fish as big as Adam's tetrapod. Interesting. Oh, so in my father's journal, I read about the whale shark, a legendary fish. He wrote that, that the fish is as big as a house. He had not seen it himself, but he heard it from Clyde who witnessed the gigantic fish. After learning of its existence, catching the whale, sh the whale shark became my father's sole purpose. He even set aside his responsibilities as a scavenger to fulfill his goal. If whale sharks are, pro are prospering out there, it means the earth is healing, right? 
That's why my father was after the huge fish, to give hope to the people of Zion. Even though I share the same goal, I know that I'm not a good enough to f I'm not a good enough fisher to catch it. If someone catches a whale shark, please scan it and send the data to me. According to my journal, only the fantastic bait can lure whale sharks. So, we're not gonna do that now. We will do that next time. Um, and to do that, we'll probably go talk to Clyde first now that we have the fantastic bait and he mentioned that if we ever get it, he'll tell us the best fishing spot that he knows of. So I'm sure that's where we can go to catch the whale shark or whatever. But yeah, we're almost done with all the side missions. Um, I'm going to see what I do after that because it seems like after we go to the orbit elevator, we're not going to be able to come back. Which means if I'm missing any cans from any areas here, then I'm just not going to be able to get it. So I may also try to collect all the cans because, I mean, that's something that I wanted to do. For now, I know this is a long and probably a boring one because I was just fishing the majority of the time. At least it was a little bit boring and repetitive for me, but thank you guys so much for watching. Please like and subscribe. I really appreciate it. And peace.